Hello guys, welcome once again. In this video, I will show you how to create a text file and write on it. So, for example, I will take a button from my toolbox and I will name it as create text file okay and I will resize my button so when I press this button it will create a text file and whatever I want to write in this text file I could be able to write so just select this button and double click it and it will lead to the code but before writing the code for the text file you need to include this using namespace system io this is for the text file and file management so you just need to include this line in wherever your using namespace collection is there so just add this line also there okay and then once again come to your a black button click event here and here write the code so we need to write stream writer and then this cap symbol and then you can give a name to your variable so out file for outputting the file is equal to gc new once again copy this stream writer and paste it here bracket and bracket closed and in here in this bracket we will write the name of our file so first of all double quotes and for example I want to name my file as test dot text file okay and you can also provide the path of the file also wherever you want your file to be created the path I just want my file to be created in the project folder so I just I'm writing this test doc dot text so this will create my text file in my project folder wherever my project is there otherwise you can provide C and this type of a path okay and then in the next line just copy this out file variable and then arrow right and bracket and bracket closed and in here we will write our code not our code but our text so let's write hello hello world and then in the next line once again copy this variable and paste it here and arrow pointer close so this is the simple code to write hello world first of all it will create a text file called test doc dot text and it will just write one line 
which is hello world and just close your file so let's try and run our code run yes and when I press this create text file button it should create a file in my folder so I press this and I go to my project folder and it has generated this text file in my project folder wherever my project is there for this Visual C++ application and then I will open this test dot text file and you can see it has written hello world in it for example if you want to add some more lines in your code so just copy this and paste it once again and after your first line here hello world you just need to add slash r slash n okay so this two line will change your line so this second line will appear on the second line otherwise if you don't provide this slash r slash n it will write your second hello world for example 2 and hello world 3 it will just write right beside this hello world which will not, not good right we want our lines to be on different lines so let's try and run our code once again run and when you press this create text file and just open your folder once again test I will open this test once again and you can see hello world hello world 2 and hello world 3 each on different line okay so in this way you can generate a text file and you can write in it you can also generate doc file or word file from it if I'm correct let's see and check if it generates the doc file also or not so run and I press this button once again and I will check the folder once again and it has created the text not the text but the doc file or word file for us and let's see if it has our and yes it has our text and this document is a word document so you can try what files are possible with this file writer or stream writer you can I think you can generate excel files also but you need to check whether I'm correct or not so I hope you have enjoyed this video and please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now